School Life Simplified, Basic English Guide with Drake and Nicole. What subjects do you study in elementary school? We studied basic subjects like math, science, and English. How many years do you go to high school? High school usually lasts for four years. What is a campus? A campus is the area where a university's buildings are located. What do you need to bring on the first day of school? You should bring your books, pens, and a notebook. How do you make friends at a new school? Join clubs or sports to meet people with similar interests. What is homework? Homework is extra work given by the teacher to do at home. Why is attendance important in school? Regular attendance helps you keep up with the lessons. What is a university degree? It's a qualification you earn after completing your university studies. How do I choose a major in university? Think about what subjects you enjoy and what job you want in the future. What is a school library for? It's a place to read, study, and borrow books. What's a teacher's office hour? It's a specific time when you can visit teachers for extra help. How do you apply to a university? Fill out an application form and sometimes take an entrance exam. What is a school uniform? It's special clothing that students wear to school. How do you prepare for exams? Study regularly and revise the topics covered in class. What are extracurricular activities? These are activities like sports and clubs, not part of the regular curriculum. What is a scholarship? It's financial aid given to students based on merit or need. Why is it important to learn a second language? It can improve job prospects and help understand other cultures. What's a science lab? It's a room with equipment for conducting scientific experiments. How do you write a research paper? Choose a topic, research it, and present your findings in writing. What is a field trip? It's an educational trip organized by the school to a place outside the classroom. What is a semester? It's half of the academic year in school or university. How do you take lecture notes effectively? Listen actively and write down key points and ideas. What's a student council? It's a group of students elected to represent the student body. Why is time management important in school? Good time management helps you balance study, work, and leisure. What are online classes? They are classes taught over the internet instead of in a classroom. How do you choose a university? Consider factors like courses offered, location, and tuition fees. What's a textbook? It's a book containing detailed information about a subject. Why do we have group projects? They teach teamwork and collaborative skills. What is a thesis? It's a long piece of writing based on your own research, usually required for a university degree. What's a gap year? It's a year taken off, often between high school and university, to travel or work. Speak English fluently. Simple lessons with real-life examples Where is Albert from? Albert is from England. What color is Fiona's car? Fiona's car is red. How old is Albert? Albert is 30 years old. What does Fiona do? Fiona is a teacher. Where does Albert live? Albert lives in London. What is Fiona's favorite color? Fiona's favorite color is blue. When does Albert go to work? Albert goes to work at 9 a.m. Why is Fiona happy? Fiona is happy because it is sunny. Who is Albert's best friend? Albert's best friend is Tom. What is Fiona cooking? Fiona is cooking pasta. Where did Albert go yesterday? Albert went to the park yesterday. How many books does Fiona have? Fiona has 10 books. What is Albert's hobby? Albert's hobby is playing guitar. Does Fiona have a pet? Yes, Fiona has a cat. What time does Albert wake up? Albert wakes up at 7 a.m. Why does Fiona read books? 
Fiona reads books to learn. Who is Albert's sister? Albert's sister is Emma. What is Fiona's favorite food? Fiona's favorite food is pizza. Where does Albert want to travel? Albert wants to travel to Australia. How does Fiona go to work? Fiona goes to work by bus. I hope these examples are useful for your English learning. Thanks for watching. Grocery shopping basic English questions and answers. What do you buy at the grocery store? I buy fruits, vegetables, milk, and bread at the grocery store. Does Albert prefer shopping in the morning or evening? Albert prefers shopping in the morning. Where is the nearest supermarket in London? The nearest supermarket in London is on Oxford Street. How often does Fiona go grocery shopping? Fiona goes grocery shopping once a week. Can you find discounts at the grocery store? Yes, you can often find discounts at the grocery store. Do you use a shopping list? Yes, I use a shopping list to remember what to buy. What is a cashier? A cashier is a person who takes payments at the store. Is the grocery store open on Sundays in New York? Yes, the grocery store is open on Sundays in New York. How do you pay for groceries in Canada? In Canada, you can pay for groceries with cash, card, or mobile pay. What is a shopping cart? A shopping cart is a large metal basket on wheels used to hold groceries while you shop. Does Fiona prefer organic food? Yes, Fiona prefers buying organic food. Are there any bakeries near the supermarket in Paris? Yes, there are several bakeries near the supermarket in Paris. Can you buy frozen food at the grocery store? Yes, you can buy frozen food at the grocery store. How do you choose fresh fruit? To choose fresh fruit, check if it's firm and smells fresh. Is bottled water cheaper than soda? Sometimes bottled water is cheaper than soda. Do you carry your own bags to the grocery store? Yes, I carry my own bags to be more eco-friendly. What is a grocery aisle? A grocery aisle is a walkway between shelves of products in the store. How do you find a good deal at the grocery store? To find a good deal, look for sales and use coupons. Can Albert buy medicine at the grocery store in the UK? Yes, Albert can buy some basic medicine at the grocery store in the UK. Why is it important to check the expiration date on food? It is important to check the expiration date to ensure the food is safe to eat. I hope these examples are useful for your English learning. Thanks for Simple English Q&A. Boost your conversational skills. Who is he? He is Victor. Who is she? She is Nicole. Is Victor new here? Yes, Victor is new here. Is Nicole your friend? Yes, Nicole is my friend. How do you know Victor? I met Victor at school. Where did Nicole come from? Nicole comes from London. What does Victor do? Victor is a teacher. Why is Nicole smiling? Nicole is happy to see you. How are you, Victor? I am good, thank you. Did Nicole say hello to you? Yes, Nicole said hello to me. Where is Victor's coat? It's in the car. Has Nicole been here long? No, she just arrived. Are you and Victor classmates? Yes, we are classmates. Did Nicole bring her bag? Yes, Nicole brought her bag. Is Victor going to the party? Yes, Victor is going to the party. What did Nicole buy? Nicole bought a book. Did you see Victor this morning? Yes, I saw Victor this morning. What is Nicole's favorite color? Nicole's favorite color is blue. Where does Victor live? Victor lives near the park. Does Nicole have a pet? No, Nicole doesn't have a pet. When did you meet Victor? I met Victor last year. 
Does Nicole speak Spanish? No, Nicole speaks French. Did Victor enjoy the movie? Yes, Victor enjoyed the movie. Where did Nicole eat lunch? Nicole ate lunch at the cafe. How old is Victor? Victor is 25 years old. Is Nicole married? No, Nicole is not married. Does Victor have a brother? Yes, Victor has a brother. Where does Nicole study? Nicole studies at the university. Maldives Adventures, a weekend getaway. Hey Rebecca, looks like you're all set for the weekend. Excited about the Maldives? Absolutely, Robert. I've heard the beaches are stunning. Have you been there before? I have, and you're in for a treat. The ocean is this incredible shade of blue. Oh, I can't wait to see it. I've only seen such colors in magazines. You'll find the reality is even better. How's your packing going? Almost done, just need to check the weather forecast to decide on the final outfits. Good idea. They say expect the unexpected when it comes to island weather. Looks like it'll be sunny all weekend. Perfect for some snorkeling and beach time. That's great. Do you know the local phrase for hello? It's always handy. Oh, I've been practicing. It's assalamu alaikum, right? Spot on. And shakuria means thank you. Shakuria, got it. How about activities? What should we not miss? Well, snorkeling is a must, and if you're up for it, there's a beginner's diving course. Diving sounds amazing, but I'm a little nervous about it. No worries. The instructors are super professional. You'll be in good hands. That's reassuring. I'd love to see the coral reefs up close. Then it's settled. We'll sign up for the diving course. After that, we can relax on the beach or try some local cuisine. I've heard Maldivian food is quite unique. What's it like? It's a delicious blend of Indian and Arabic influences. Lots of seafood, of course. Can't wait to try it. And I'd love to bring back some spices. Definitely. The local market is the perfect place for that. And remember, bartering is key. I'll remember that. Thanks, Robert. This trip is going to be incredible. My pleasure, Rebecca. It's always more fun to travel with friends. Let's make the most of it. Hello. How are you? I'm good. Thank you. Hi. Are you new here? Yes, it's my first time here. How do you do? I'm fine. Thanks. Good morning, Olivia. How was your night? Morning, Richard. I slept well. Hey, are you Richard's friend? Yes, I am. My name's Olivia. What's your name? My name is Richard. Excuse me, are you Olivia? Yes, I am. And you? Pleased to meet you. My name's Richard. Nice to meet you too, Richard. Do you know where Olivia is? Yes, she's in the library. Hi, Olivia. Is this your book? Yes, it is. Thank you. How's it going, Richard? Not bad, Olivia. Thanks for asking. Hello. I haven't seen you before. What's your name? I'm Richard. I'm new here. Olivia, is that your pen? No, it isn't. Richard, can you help me with this? Of course, Olivia. Hi. Are you Olivia's brother? No, I'm just a friend. My name's Richard. What's your last name, Olivia? It's Brown. Richard, is this your coat? No, that's not mine. Good afternoon, Olivia. How's your day? It's going well, Richard. 
Thanks. Hey, Richard. Have you met Olivia? No, I haven't. Hello, Olivia. Hello, Olivia. Where are you from? I'm from London. How about you, Richard? Richard, how old are you? I'm 25 years old. What do you do, Olivia? I'm a teacher. Good evening, Richard. Did you have dinner? Not yet, Olivia. How about you? Hello, Richard. Do you speak Spanish? No, I don't. Only English. Hey, Olivia. What's your favorite color? It's blue. Richard, do you have a pet? Yes, I have a cat. Olivia, do you like coffee? Yes, I love coffee. Hi, Richard. Is this your seat? Yes, it is. Hey, Olivia. Do you know Richard? Yes, we're classmates. Hello, Richard. When's your birthday? It's on July 10th. Thanks for